Well hello no, YouTubers, inside these boxes I have a cheap set of hydraulic disc brakes. These are about £35 on eBay. They're Bucklow's brand hydraulic disc brakes. Bucklow's hydraulic disc brake. You can see it says Bucklow's right there. Um, it's got a picture of like, the British flag in there, but I'm pretty sure these are made in China. And Bucklow's is just a distributor, a British distributor, so UK seller if you will. Which means it's actually going to turn up in the, the post on time, and it did turn up really, really quickly. Um, Mineral oil only. Some of the IS mount adapters. Look really, really good. Right. Let's pull the plastic off quickly. I tried their forks out. Well, the, the fork that I know is the same fork they use. The, um, KRSEC and the um, Lutus and the forks I was not impressed by at all. It was basically just a rebadged sun, like sun, the gub into the sun tour stuck inside an even worse chassis. But these, these look really good. Yeah, got lever reach adjustment there. I mean, alright, CNC machine finish on the edge there is not perfect, but you know. In fact, that looks like that. Yeah, that would have been done after the fact. That might have even been done by hand, you know. The, um, a deburrer. Yeah, I think that looks like it's been hand finished. Just the outer edge, a bit of the silver piece. So, you know, there's like a sharp tool you can buy. And it will do that. So, that would explain why it looks like that. Meant for, um, deburring things so they're not sharp. Basically. So maybe that was done after the fact because they weren't satisfactory that the finish was uh, not sharp, it was too sharp or whatever. So they just, and they wanted it to look, yeah, it was pretty good. They, you can, you don't need to take your grips off to fit these to the bike as well. So these Bucklow's brakes are good in that respect. I mean, this is only a uh, initial unboxing. I've not used these yet. These are going on a really fast electric bike to test them out. And uh, yeah, we'll see what they're like. So this uh, clamp here looks... Uh, it's pretty good. It looks eh, kind of. It looks not that substantial, but you know what I mean. I've seen far worse, including a set of Hope brakes I actually bought back in the day. I cannot remember the mon model. I think Mono Mini, something like that. And this piece broke on the handlebars, but it was clamped in such a weird way that it stayed on there, so it didn't really matter too much. But one of the bolts broke, or not the bolt, but the actual bracket broke. Comes with some mounting hardware. Annoyingly, oh, I have spotted something a little annoying. To make up the adapter, they've copied the, the old Avid, Avid mounting system. So they use V-brake um, spacers <laughs> to, um, you know, make up the gap between it. And they're, they're cheap, they're commonly available, but they're not that precise. They could be um, slightly out of true and they're sort of rounded. So setting these up is a bit, might be a little bit more tricky than like Shimano. But it's not going to be any worse than Avid, so... I don't like that about Avid brakes either, but they seem to work alright, to be honest, even though it just seems a bit janky that they're using the V-brake spaces, but yeah, it works, and they're commonly available, so you don't lose them. Hey ho, you've got, you can easily get them, <laughs> that's not a problem there. And for the price, the Bucklow's brakes seem pretty good, so unpack unpackage these ones. Tip. Look at the others. Oh, hang on. This anodising look brighter to you. It's probably a different batch, but this looks more pinky red. Yeah. This one here is more like red red. And this one is like a totally different shade of red. More like a pinky sort of colour. Okay. The finish is also better on this one. See, this looks like it's been sandblasted with a much, much uh, harder grip than this one. This one looks far better. <laughs> this almost looks like Hope quality. Yeah, it's almost like I've got the one in the picture. <laughs> it's a bit of a shame not both like that, though. Just just little things, you know. I mean, it's they're cheap as hell, but the colour doesn't match those. Like, <laughs> If you're a colour connoisseur, I'm not a colour connoisseur, but I do notice stuff like this. Um, and this one is definitely a slightly different colour to this one. You're not going to see it from a distance, but, you know. 
So if you're running a back brake only, there's no chance of having that issue because you just have one brake. It's almost like they do, I didn't see a different colour red in the listing, so it's not like someone sent me a, uh, a different colour. Unless it just, like, someone doesn't know. <laughs> yeah, hang on, yeah, look, hang, hang on a minute, yeah. <laughs> look at that. The, um, the bit that goes on the handlebars is a different colour, so I'd have to look into it. I'll put it in the comments section. Maybe this is actually a different, uh, is a different colour, and the guy sent me. And this is also made of steel. This little bracket here <laughs> is a piece of, like, bent steel. And this one... Is a piece of aluminium. I mean, obviously, this is cheaper to make than this, but. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, we'll see how they perform. Um, the, you know, the fact that little things like this are going on could mean. I don't know, either this is a different revision, and they, no one checked the revision. Also, one of them come in a smaller box than the other one, as you saw. So yeah, it's a bit of a weird one. We'll see how they actually work and function though. That's the uh, proof in the pudding, right? Let's see what the lever's like. There's no flex from side to side in a lever. Or very little. So, yeah. What pads do these use? They use the round style pads, like Tetro. And Promax. I'm not sure about um, getting another set. The Zoom ones use Shimano pads, they're a bit easier to uh, get pads for. But, um, hey ho, we'll see what they're like. Thank you for watching. That concludes the video on the Bucklow's hydraulic disc brakes. Bucklow's hydraulic disc brakes, people. Thank you for watching.